the pictures too. We like the, the sure. anecdotes. Um, how badly would you have liked to have gone to a camp oh. that focused on unleashing your inner rock star, Ryan? Well, and here, I know you probably don't want to say this in front of the campers themselves, but is bad behavior actually rewarded at the camp? Well, sort of. Wouldn't you think? Well, totally. Like, they're supposed to trash their dorm rooms, right? This ain't your mama's band camp, you know oh, what I'm saying? Absolutely. <laughs> I don't even know what I just said. <laughs> but truly, Ryan, I know you are a rock star behind the uh, the kit. We're going to actually go and, and see. This is more of a, a subdued trio right now. But wait till you see them rocking out, Ryan Jesperson. I'll get to that in a mere moment. But right now, I want to tell our viewers, share with our viewers what we're doing here. I'm going to first bring in Martha Livingston, who is sort of the genius, the mind. Come on over here here yeah this is this is your baby girlfriend and uh, lovely to see you great to see you Bridget thanks for coming out this morning a lot of kids scratching their heads going way too good to be true this camp takes place out of the city over a, a couple of weeks period in Camrose at Augustana University campus and uh, it's there's one camp in July and one camp in August one week each and the kids come and they rock out all day take classes they they make music from morning till night as much noise as they want and at the end of the week we have a big concert fans have been emerged from here uh, they've been created they've been, and, and so if you're wondering you know Martha's one of the sort of mentors as well this gentleman Logan who is he going holy moly is that Logan from social code it is indeed and you're sort of one of the mentors as well you could say that yeah we've been asked to come and play for the first week of camp you know the whole band's gonna be there we're gonna do a show and then we'll answer questions and you know answer whatever they want to know before I have to throw it back to Ryan, because I know him and I and all of you want to know, top three things you can recommend on just becoming a rock star. Mindset, though, not necessarily, you know, musicianship-wise. Mindset of a rock star. First of all, I'd like to say nice tap. Thank you very much. Uh, top three things. Wow. From a mindset standpoint, really, there's only one thing. Nobody can tell you that you can't. You can't accept that ever. So you have to accept that people will say things and people will criticize because it's in an industry where art, you know, is criticized, but you just can't accept it. You have to believe in yourself and you go. And there's nothing else, really. But no doesn't exist, Ryan. It doesn't exist. It's not an option. Yes, I am a rock star yeah. like you are. And it's a great life principle anyway. Words of wisdom. Love you it. You sound pretty good. All right, B, we're going to chat with you again in just a little bit from Rockstar Camp. Hey, hey. Buddy. Yes, indeed, we are here in St. Albert, Camp Rockstar. Ever dreamed of being in front of thousands of screaming, raging fans, all with one thing on their mind, and that is you? Oh, yes, this is the camp. If you would like to unleash your inner rock star, if you are a teenager and you're thinking this is the life for me, um, then we've been sort of focusing all of the... Uh, morning on on giving you just the tools to do that camp rockstar is a place where you can unleash and we're gonna meet another awesome rock and roll band i'm gonna say this one dominated by chicks which is so very cool they uh go by the name of hit reply and let's meet right now i'm guessing you are the front runner because you've got the microphone and no instrument she needs no instrument but you need an introduction your name my name is jennifer jennifer sweet okay welcome and uh hit reply what is the sort of give me a sense of what this band is about what what sounds do you like and what would you like to be likened to well, this band's kind of like, it's a little bit lighter of rock. It's more of like an acoustic-ish mm -hmm. rock. It's just not as heavy as normal bands. But I mean, sometimes that's good, sometimes it's different. Now, you've been to Camp Rockstar before. Yeah. Now, tell me how much fun is it? It is amazing. It is incredible. The best camp ever. You were told not to say that there's body surfing. There's not mosh pits. There's none of that. None of that, hey. No, they would never do yeah. that. But you do have a good time in the cafeteria eating lunch. Yes. The food is amazing. <laughs> it is. <laughs> okay, let's go meet the rest of the band. You are... I'm Cassandra. Cassandra, awesome. And you play the bass. Sweet. Do you have any sort of tricks of the trade with the bass? Like, do you lick it? Do you play? No, I just... I pluck. She plucks. She plucks. That's fantastic. And a dude, you are? I'm Riley. Riley, and you play the... I'm the early guitar player. Okay, so what rocks you out? What makes you a rock star? I stick with this guitar. I, I run around and try to have fun with everybody. We'll see about that in mere seconds. And you are? I'm Jen. Jen, and this is an acoustic guitar. Yeah. Wait, I already like the deal of sounds. And what do you do? Can you play it on your back and you play it upside down? Yeah, I can. <laughs> Hard. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, we'll get, a, we'll get a sight of that as well. And on the drums, before we let them rip it up, here you are. I'm Justin. Justin, what is up? You got that sort of like, I'm too busy being a rock star to talk to you kind of too. <laughs> there you go. Okay, we're going to get out of the way. They are Hit Reply, and here they are on BT.